User-generated content, or UGC, is taking storm and we're seeing all kinds of contributors across the world making content pushing products. My name is Stephen Pope, I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy, and in this video I'm going to give you a rare take on why I think UGC is going to be pushed onto Amazon, and if nothing less, you need to start investing in it on TikTok and push content visitors over to your Amazon platform. To first kick things off, I'm gonna showcase my own UGC that came in this morning on one of my products. I was really excited about this. They did a really great job. We're gonna go full screen here and I'm gonna hit play and comment. Back again with another Disney Amazon find. This Age of Sage Grogu Tumblr is a must have for any Disney adult. She starts the video with a close up shot with hands, freaking love it. She transitions the video by pulling the cup into the camera just did a really good job. It's the perfect size for any drink. Double insulated, which is perfect. She next does some show and tell with a full body shot. Most UGC people are like, oh, let me just show you with my hands. They don't get on camera. They don't show your face. They don't do any of the contextual banana for scale shots. I think she did a great job. She transitions and shows the versatility. She shows you can put coffee in it. It's perfect for hot and cold drinks. It keeps my morning coffee warm for up to four hours, and it's so versatile that I can also use it as a wine tumbler. Also, make great transition, very short, quick, shows coffee, shows wine. Thanks for a great gift for any Disney Star Wars. Oh my gosh, I can't believe she dressed up with some Grogu ears right here and a t-shirt. She just went all in. This is some of the best UGC I have ever received on one of my products. I'm so excited about it. Lover. Get yours now on Amazon by searching Age of Sage Grogu. Hear that again? Search it on Amazon by searching Age of Sage Grogu, right? So if we go over to Amazon and do that, here's what comes up. And it's our product right there in slot number one. We do run a little bit of a risk of the other items getting clicked here. I do have my second item right there with the This Is The Way, uh, which is good. And my Age of Sage brand is getting advertising, which is good there too. But we added the word Grogu, Age of Sage Grogu. So they click on this product and then make the purchase. Now, some of you are going to say, well, how many people actually do this? How much of an impact can this make? Well, we know that Amazon rewards traffic. And we also know that there's a way to see how many people are looking at my brand. So if you have a tool like Helium 10, which I've got installed here, here is a way to see how many people are searching for your brand at any given time. So we can see show full summary, click on this product, uh, button right here, and it's gonna populate a bunch of data to help us understand how many people are searching the product. And that's gonna be very valuable for us to know, and I'll show you why in a second. So uh, clicking, let's see, maybe I clicked the wrong thing. Hold on, let me click, oh, here we go. Top right there, you can see top left, 2,100 people search volume, and that's on a monthly basis. But if we click into this little trend chart here and expand it out, so I average about a thousand people or just under that on a monthly basis, um, or it looks like this is actually a weekly basis, excuse me, weekly basis. So now here is when I release some of my UGC right around August 19th, we started coming out with it and then boom, all of a sudden 3000 searches a week for my brand for Age of Sage. And it's already started going back down after some of our advertising campaigns on TikTok um, transitioned out. We're going with a new round. We just got that new video I just showcased. And we're gonna go for a second round because we believe it's working and we're seeing some sales growth. So you can actually see the impact of this. A lot of the attribution links with UGC and TikTok absolutely do not work. They're garbage programs. But here is a classic way to, to gauge how effective it is it tripled the amount of people looking for my brand name overnight. So this is the impact of UGC. You can see it, feel it, touch it, see the results. Here is data proof. It is driving traffic to Amazon. So that's great. In addition to that, I've also been able to see sales to my soaps and my other products that I've run these videos to go up and I've, I've seen record BSRs. And this is without any additional Amazon advertising. We've seen the BSR for some of my soaps go from 12,000 up to 8,000. Uh, and I've never been that high before. I'll showcase some of those products for you guys. So I'm gonna go to amazon.com slash age of sage and you'll see my products right here. So our macho soaps, our masculine, damsel, good and evil, and a bunch of other products. We've seen the BSRs spike to new highs and you can correlate when the traffic on TikTok is going to Amazon. Even though the Amazon attribution shows zero sales, 
my sales velocity went up, which is how we know it's working and it's a good thing and that's super helpful. So I, I do think I'm gonna bet long on TikTok ads. Uh, however, they did um, prevent links going directly from TikTok into Amazon. That's brand new. Uh, they just changed that in the last week or so. So you can't like push direct ad traffic over to Amazon. But because I'm in uh, frozen hell with TikTok shop, I can't get through the verification process. And I know a lot of other businesses that are also stuck. It seems like the TikTok uh, business verification is broken. It's only working for individuals. And it's super easy to put a social security number in and be done. But the business verifications are not working. I don't know if it's because TikTok wants uh, to not have businesses and they just want to have the regular Joe Schmo users. I don't know what it is, uh, but you can't, it's really hard to get through that. We've, we've done some other content. We've had multiple meetings, getting, getting stuck there. I do believe TikTok shop is going to start to take off. If you're an Amazon brand, should you spend time working on it? I don't know at this point. Um, but you need to pay attention, maybe get, keep that podcast on in case it spikes and, and try it, maybe open the account just in case. But in the meantime, I'm a big fan of this concept of getting UGC. We're gonna, we're gonna post this video over onto our Grogu listing, and we're gonna try and get more content like this. Now, at the same time, you can get some content that is a little not so great. This is a video that might be a little nightmare inducing hi lisa here and this company called age of sage sent me this awesome little tumbler isn't it cute it's 12 ounces and it's double insulated so that means it keeps your hot liquids warm for hot for up to four hours and your cold drinks cold for up to 11 hours so let's make a cup of coffee all right so far okay a little long a little slow Pour my water into my coffee pot. She's cropping her face off, can't even see. I got my coffee in there. Let's hit brew, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, my coffee's done. Let's put some stuff in it. First thing I'm gonna put in is a little baking soda. It takes out the bitterness of the coffee, and it helps with any kind of heartburn that you might have. I don't drink coffee, I don't so have I have no idea that's a thing. Then I'm gonna take a tablespoon of uh, MCT oil. This helps with brain fog. It helps get some good body fat or the good uh, fat that you need in your body for the keto diet. I wish diet. you did a little bit it of editing. It also helps with, um, did I say brain fog? Yeah, you did. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good for you. <laughs> this two minute then video could have been- a couple pumps of this. This two minute video could have been 20 seconds. It would have been eight times better. Skinny syrup glazed donut. just going all in with this and then I'm gonna take this is where the controversy lies no this does not break my fast because I'm only take a tad bit yeah if you're drinking coffee you're not insulin, fasting I'm sorry therefore it doesn't raise doesn't break my fast and so this comes with a little handy dandy lid it's supposed to be sealed real airtight oops I got too much in here too much coffee. Oops, I'll be right back. Got my mess cleaned up. And yes, this is airtight. <coughs> A little lid. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. It's real tight. Yeah. So sometimes Ooh, that's hot. when you invest in content, you're going to get done. my uh, link in my bio. Like this. And this is in my Amazon storefront. But Which I did play the, play the full video season. and I did watch it's it so several cute. times. And know that you're highly valued maybe, and I love you. Have a great day. Maybe somebody else is going to, you know, watch it for the cringe worthiness. I don't know. Like that one guy from Weber State University that was cooking um, macaroni and cheese in the microwave and acting like it was like a souffle. Right. I don't know. Maybe we're going to advertise both of those videos. One was incredibly better and one I'm proud of to put on my own listing. And the other one, man, I, I, I might have nightmares after watching that one. But I paid the same amount to both UGC creators. And so you have to go hire like 10 of them to get one quality one, and you're gonna get a couple like that not quality one. But then when you go run the advertising dollars on TikTok, you may find the click-through rate is better on the terrible one. And so it'll surprise you sometimes. So you gotta test them all. 
and see what happens. Um, I've started to partner up with the TikTok agency. Uh, so if you guys are curious, you want to you want to work with us on some of this stuff, send an email over to podcast at myamazonguy.com. Be happy to make an introduction, see if we can help you out. Uh, in the meantime, start investing in UGC video content. It's coming a long way. Got to go, 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 uh, go do some grow goose. All right. My name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of my Amazon guy. Check out these videos next on some other actionable tips to grow your sales on Amazon.